hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i want to show you guys how i created this side french i'm gonna start from the very beginning when i file and buff all the way to the end where we add the top coat so uh, keep on watching So I recently started using the alcohol prep pads to um, wipe off the nails and kind of dehydrate them and it makes it so easy to remove all of the lint and everything and then primer is definitely optional. I feel that it helps my polish adhere better um, but it's totally optional. Okay, and now for the color. So normally with the color, I'll do two to three coats, sometimes four, but I felt like with this color, three was just the perfect amount. And then when you do like three plus coats, it adds more strength to the nail as well. So I like to keep that in mind. Um, it just depends on the color I'm using, the shape, the length, on how many um, layers I like to do. Okay, so now I'm adding the matte top coat to seal in the color and my customer requested a glossy side French. So that was exciting. I um, have never done that. So basically I just top coated in matte and then I'm going to add in the side French and then we're gonna gloss top coat only the side French. So that way that matte still is on the nude color and it came out super cute. Okay, so now we're gonna get into that side French. Um, this brush right here is from Beatles. It is amazing. It was my first time using it because I just bought it, I messed up my old brush, but it was my first time using it and this brush was so amazing and so precise. So I'm definitely gonna link that down below so that way you guys can go get it. It came with, I think five other ones um, and it wasn't even it was like eight dollars for it so yeah it helped so much to create that side French and then I just go in with the regular polish to fill that in and make it completely um, polished
And for this part right here, I like to cure each individual one just so that way I know that that polish is in place and it's not going to run down the side anywhere or move at all because you want that line to stay super precise. So I just throw that in the lamp right away so that way it, it um, cures it right away. second coat of color just to make that um, more opaque and with this one I will add the color and then I'll cure all of them at the same time because we're not really too worried about it moving now that we have that bottom layer already cured.
okay and now for the last part the glossy top coat um we are only top coating the orange color because my customer requested the nude color to be matte and then the orange color to be glossy and that came out super cute Okay, and this is the final look you guys look how cute it came out i absolutely am loving the way the matte with gloss side tip looks um thank you so much for requesting this custom set uh, if i lost anybody anywhere just let me know down below if you guys have any questions anything like that just let me know um don't forget to like comment subscribe thank you guys bye